one for about five minutes. Okay, Four that's fine. Four to five minutes, I'm guessing. Maybe even less. So it's not going to run for a really long time. But it's going to go through and demonstrate everything in there. You'll see the multi-tools operating. Uh, it'll run half the uh, ten tools. Can you pause it? Yep. So if you feel like you want to be somewhere else, just tell them to pause it and then you can move. Well, he's going to yep. have two cameras too, so... So that's what I'm doing. So whenever you're yep. ready, we're on. The All film right. is on. Let me uh, also run you around. So it's the so basically what it's going to do. I want to be in it. <laughs> first thing we'll do. In fact, I'll even start from the beginning. I'll reference it. Okay. You know that's probably pretty boring to see, but it, you see the things going. That we they people know it actually fires up. It references so it finds all of its zeros. Then it's going to set the clamps. Then go back to there. It's going to pick up the sheet, pull it up in there, spray it and start punching a bunch of holes. Tools are going to be indexing. So if you're interested in the small. indexing tools, get an angle. We yeah, if, it, if it's doing everything else. And you're so from here, you're not going to see anything indexing. You'll hear it going, wah, wah, Okay, wah. that's fine. Then gong, gong, gong. Uh, it's going to go through a bunch of that. This table at the end is going to open up. It's going to go into there, shear. I don't know, even know what it's shearing. Some parts out. It's going to shear some stuff out of it. We're going to drop them out there. It's going to land on the floor because we don't have a bucket there yet. Um, so, we don't okay, have a bucket. let's, uh, fall let's on index the, uh, so the clamps. But it's uh, probably going to cut the least this wire. But now what's going to happen first, you're going to see this come down to take the metal and put it in. So that's probably important for us to see that as well after he gets the reference.
still have to go to the other side. We'll pause it. I'll bring the camera around the other side.
home position. And we can see the sheet stock has been cut, ready to be separated. So we have our three exit tables on the other side for collecting parts. Our movable table. The oil cooler. The turret. The finger mechanism. The chip conveyor. The sorry, you're doing fine. I was gonna do what you're doing. I was gonna take a uh, get that tower. Yeah, we'll get it. And I wanted to scan those books and stuff too. Do you want to get a picture of some of the finished parts? Back to on? where we started from in the beginning. No, I, I can get them. Mm -hmm. well, we can just we can just do it. There's parts everywhere here. Okay. All right. So we're gonna open the uh, turret box. Table slides back. We can see the turret in place here. And here are some of the tools. See if we can all get a wiggle around here. Good. And we can see the turret in motion. And that's good. I think that's good. Fine. Let's bring it back to a position, then we'll close the table up. Now the control. Excuse me. Yeah. All these people walking around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I am too. Yeah. We'll be all be on YouTube in a day or so. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. Now, can we uh, open this door again? Have a look inside. Starting at the bottom, we have a transformer, a power supply, control. And over here we have the back of the CRT, which is uh, less than two years old. Okay, come on. Want to see the, the breaker pin or all the contactors? Yeah, if we can. Tool for opening that. Probably come around the side here. Good. Okay, and the breaker panel. All nice and clean. The machine's been well maintained. As you can see, there's no dirt. Everything is working. All right, let's close that door. I can go through and cycle any of the other features you might be interested in, like that. Uh, you want to zoom in, just seeing the turret spinning around. Um, can we get these three? And these three tables here, these three roller conveyor tables. Yep. Can we just get them to? Cycle once. All right. Well, they're for. Uh, if not, we. If not, that's okay. But these three tables, they lift up for three different sets of parts. Yes. You. And you there have. Should be belts for these here. Belts, in fact, are there. Okay. The motors need to be replaced. Okay. For the last two. All right. So, so they each have belts, and depending on who, which one is lifted, the uh, finished parts will fall down in below. Yep. Which I had that on this one, yep. on this video, if it right. helps you any. Yeah, and then we so had the other parts. If I disconnected at some time this motor. Sorry. Right. Because. Though that's good. Uh, don't worry about it, Jim. Sorry, we'll do this. I, yeah. I, I don't know, are you going to be using this splice in this? These yeah, two? we're going to try and splice it. Because I, I got this coming up and down. Yeah, I do too. So that's okay. good. All right, and now we're at the back side of the machine. I, the cycle. Than me. Uh, I don't know. A movie. So we have about uh, three minutes and fifteen seconds. I can